The Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra will be the company's next flagship device, with some incredible specs. One of the most noticeable cosmetic changes on the S23 and S23 Plus will be its camera sensors, which will be different from last year and will not have a camera bump on the rear side. We have distinct camera lenses on the rear of the S23 and S23 Plus, which are in line with the Galaxy S23 Ultra, making them a series that is totally comparable in terms of camera design. Another feature that I particularly like about the S23 Ultra based on these dummy units is its beautiful flat display. Flat screens are more easy to operate, and there are less inadvertent touches. If the device falls, the flat display will increase its durability since the curved display will cause some harm to the device and having a flat display will provide even more durability to the device. Another benefit of the flat display is that using the S Pen will be much more convenient than using the curved display, thus I'm hoping that Samsung will introduce the flat display to their S23 Ultra device. We do have bigger 200 megapixel camera sensors, however the size of the camera sensor on the rear side will be smaller. The reason for this is because the body will be a bit thicker than the S22 Ultra, which will disguise the thickness of the camera. Next, when we compare the S Pen stylus for the S22 Ultra to the S23 Ultra, it seems that the S23 Ultra has a somewhat bigger S Pen. We'll have to wait till the formal debut to discover whether it's real. This year, one of the largest leaps that Samsung is making is in the battery department. Here, we have some improvements as well, such as some elements that are delivering the performance increase in terms of the battery, such as the display, which consumes more power in any smartphone. It will be 45% more power efficient, plus we have a new fingerprint sensor that uses less power, and we also have one of the most significant things, the Snapdragon 8 General 2 processor, which will deliver 45% greater power efficiency in both the CPU and GPU departments than its predecessor. So absolutely combining all of them will cause the battery life to be even greater than the previous year S22 Ultra and you guys the unpacking event will be occurring in February next year in San Francisco and this will be the first time we've seen an in-person event since the COVID-19 impact. So it will undoubtedly be beneficial. So, without been said, let me know your thought in the comment below, and if you are new here please subscribe, peace out.